So we just got back from a beach vacation and I'm not a beach person, I'd rather be in the mountains, but it was a vacation that was kind of gifted to me, so um, that's where we were. So because I don't really like the beach that much, I went shopping. I uh, went to Old Town Pottery, I went to, well we ate at Paula Deen, so I got something from the Paula Deen store, TJ Maxx, JCPenney's, and Simply Southern, and there might be something else in there, I'm forgetting. So I thought it'd be kind of fun to just kind of show you what I got. So I think I'm gonna start with Old Time Pottery. I think that was the first store I went to. And I didn't pick up a lot of things at each store, just, you know, wasting time doing some flat shop. Um, outside on our front deck, I have a glider and a chair and I have green cushions in them. And this uh, is the color of the green on the cushion. And so I have two pillows out there that are kind of worn, kind of misshapen where I washed them and stuff. So I'm gonna let them go. And I thought I'd replace that with this one. I would have liked to have gotten two, but they only had this one. Another thing, while I was on beach vacation, I'm really dreaming about sweater weather because I love fall. So I picked up a, quite a few fall things in my shopping excursion. Um, I got this from Old Time Pottery. It's just, you know, a squishy fabric uh, pillow. The stem is a little hard. Uh, it was $4.99. I may not tell you what the prices are on everything because I'm probably gonna forget some, but I just thought this was cute. And this is the last thing I picked up at Old Time Pottery. I'm really into the uh, country truck theme when it comes to Christmas and fall. And I just thought this would be really cute. Um, it's got gourds and pumpkins in it and stuff. It was $7.99. But I just thought it was kind of cute. Uh, I guess we'll go to Simply Southern. Um, I wanted, my daughter got me this shirt from Simply Sub Southern uh, a couple of Christmases ago, and I love this shirt. They didn't have any of these in this style. I like this kind because it's um, a lot softer and thinner. But I did pick up a t-shirt while I was there. The front of it just has a little sunflower on it, but the back says kindness is essential, and it has a bicycle on it, and I love to decorate with uh, bicycles. And it seems like, it seems softer than some of the other Simply Southern shirts, so I thought that was really cute. This was my favorite. Like I said, I'm loving fall. I love sweatshirts. That's why I really prefer cold weather because I love sweatshirts. And I really like this when I found it. I think it says blessed. It has pumpkin on it. And then down the side, of course, in glitter, it has the Simply Southern logo. But I love the color and um, can't wait for fall so I can wear it. Okay, so I also went to Kohl's. I had a whole cart full of clothes with the anticipation or the hope that I could try clothes on. But you know, with all that's going on right now, at JCPenney's, which I went to, I'll show you what I got, I was allowed to try things on. Their dressing rooms were open, but I was very sadly disappointed when I found out that Kohl's just, um, dressing rooms were not open, so I had to put a lot of clothes back. I did, however, get this shirt. It is uh, Under Armour and it just says Under Armour on it. But no, I'm not a big workout fanatic. Um, but I, I got it because it's really loose fitting. It's black, black is slimming. So it's cool. It's, um, I think it's the dry fit kind. And so yeah, it keeps you cool. And so uh, I thought that would be great. It fit nice. I did try it on over my shirt in front of a mirror since I couldn't go to the dressing room. I also got this hat. Um, I don't really wear hats a lot, but for those days when I need to run out the house and I haven't showered yet, it's good to have one to throw on. I put it on now, but it'll ruin my hair. But um, anyway, I just, it was cute. It fits nice. It's uh, it kind of adjusts to your head. So um, even though this, you know, might would fit somebody with a larger head, it also fits mine because it adjusts quite so. So that's what I got at Kohl's. So um, we went to the mall one day and uh, I was looking for some bottoms to go with my bathing suit, but not necessarily bathing suit bottoms. I wanted like some black shorts, kind of like biker shorts, but these were a little bit longer than what I wanted, but I figured um, I can wear them like, you know, with t-shirts in the summertime and stuff. So I just got some simple black um, biker shorts. Oh, I've got them turned wrong set outwards. <laughs> Now, this was one of my favorites because I got a lot of fall stuff from TJ Maxx. 
Um, I got this scented fall filler. It smells so good. It smells just like fall. It's called Sparkling Pumpkin. It's just got, you know, uh, pine cones and different things in it that, you know, you put it in a filler bowl or I have a big, kind of like a mason jar. It's not a mason jar, but it's kind of like a big mason jar. I'm thinking, I was thinking maybe I would put that in there for that. And I am a sucker for the very soft blankets. And I'm, I know I have a fall blanket already, I'm pretty sure, but this one just caught my eye. It's got uh, pumpkins and flowers and says happy fall. And so it, it never hurts to have too many blankets. I also got another fall blanket. Um, I'm thinking more of Thanksgiving really for it though, because it does say thankful on it and gather. And um, I actually saw this one first. It's got you know leaves and gourds and pumpkins on it. And so I thought it would be nice. I don't know if you can tell, but I have two blankets on my couch now. So I figure I'll just put both of these up for fall probably. And that is all I got from TJ Maxx. So the first day that we were on vacation, we had to run by the grocery store and pick up some drinks and snacks for the week. And lo and behold, these pumpkins were at the Kroger. And they're like, I don't know, like ceramic, I guess. These will be outside pumpkins, of course. And you know, they have a spot back for you to put uh, candles in. They're really nice. And I mean, I think they were a good price. They were $24.99, but they're super heavy. These will be going outside on my deck or porch in the yard, who knows. So the very last thing that I have, I bought from the Paula Deen restaurant gift store I guess you'd say and if you've never eaten at Paula Deen's restaurant you should it's great it's like a family table it's almost like buffet but like you order the items they bring to your table but they'll keep refilling but it was really good and um, about this it's a uh, very heavy wrought iron and it says hey y'all um, I don't know if I'm gonna put this on my fence as fence decoration or uh, I thought about possibly putting it on my deck railing. I'm not sure where I'm putting it yet, but um, it was $19.99, which I was kind of surprised with the weight of it and everything. I thought it would be more. And um, I, the, a lot of the items in the store were not as priced as high as I thought they would be. So that was good. Um, so that concludes my little so I just thought I'd do this little haul video because I like watching these kind of videos on YouTube. Kind of see what people are buying for fall decoration or, you know, just whatever. So. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching this video.